copper thieves in northern New Mexico knocked out power to homes and businesses and sent emergency dispatch departments scrambling. And this is not the first time. News 13's Carlos Sosa has that story. They will be charged with the federal charge. Española Police Chief Misel Garcia is talking about an incident from early Friday afternoon. Someone cut off five to six feet of copper wire on the Santa Clara Pueblo, critical to providing phone service in surrounding areas. That left many homes and businesses on the Pueblo and in western Española without landline service, as well as the Española Police Department and Santa Clara Tribal Police. That incident also took down our 911 dispatch center, which is located on the western side of the of Española, of the city. Emergency dispatch was back up by the end of the weekend, but this isn't the first time someone has cut telephone wires. Chief Garcia says it's happened three times in a little more than a year. After the first incident, the department came up with a backup plan, which they rolled out again. The plan in place, all 911, all 911 calls went through the Los Alamos dispatch and then they were rerouted back into our dispatch center. We have a backup phone system, so we were utilizing that backup phone system uh, through Los Alamos to assist us. On any given day, Española Police receives 115 emergency calls and close to 400 non-emergency calls. The department also had extra officers on the west side and assistance from other agencies. We alert the New Mexico State Police, we alert our, our uh, county sheriff, the Rio Riva County Sheriff's Department, our Santa Clara uh, Tribal Police Partners and uh, just uh, to the north, our O.K. Wingate Tribal Police Partners, and we all work together. Meanwhile, Chief Garcia says they are taking extra measures to prevent this from happening again. We realize that now uh, a better surveillance system, potentially putting up more fences, being able to better protect those wires. Carlos. Now, since this happened on tribal land, anyone arrested will face federal charges for interfering with communications. Española police are asking anyone with information to contact them.